Friends, welcome to my workplace at Ranaghat, West Bengal, India. Let us observe this totally unedited surgery. You are going to see the magic of pre-chopper. This is the main incision with a 2.8 mm steel keratome on the posterior aspect of the limbus. The anterior chamber is then filled up with viscoelastic substance. A side port is made on the left side of the main incision with a lance tip knife. It's done. And now, capsulorexis. Capsulorexis is done with this instrument. This is a utrita forceps. At this time, we have to keep an eye on the anterior chamber depth. If the chamber becomes shallow, take care. Inject visco to half of the rexis, inject visco and do the rest. If you just lift off the anterior wall of the main wound, the chamber remains stable. Now see the magic of this bridge chopper. It engages here, the nucleus sustainer hooks the opposite equator, the two instruments come to each other and see the beautiful two heminuclei. Then this heminucleus is divided into two and then we turn and come to the other heminucleus and this is also divided into. Only thing is I could keep the anterior chamber depth okay but in your hands, what is going to happen is you are going to lose chamber. That is because you are going to press the posterior wall of the main wound, posterior wall of the side port, and visco is going to come out. Just take care of the anterior chamber depth and do this pre chop. You will save a lot of ultrasonic energy and it is going to be a safe surgery for soft cataracts. Soft cataracts up to grade 2 nuclear sclerosis or even uh, a grade between grade 2 and grade 3 up to grade 3 you can divide the nucleus in this way. Hard cataracts also can be divided you know in some cases with 2-3 attempts you go come back and go again at a deeper uh, go again forward at a deeper plane in that way you can do the pre chopping of a hard nucleus but in hard nucleus it is not necessary you can do the submarine chop technique for hard cataracts the cortex has been cleaned by the handpiece itself uh, this is uh, a tricky business don't try this unless you have done about 2000 surgeries and now this is the implantation of uh, hydrophobic acrylic single piece monofocal intraocular lens. The lens has gone in the capsular bag. Poster capsule is polished and it is done. This is a little bit of moxifloxacin. The side port is closed. We can just do a little bit of hydration. Not much of hydration is required to seal the wound firmly. And then we do a final lavage of the anterior chamber. Go behind the eye well center the eye well nicely, come to the wound, hold the simco in a slant way, and come out. It is done. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills and you are going to learn
pre-chopping of the nucleus.